Yeah, I see some people saying they tip Kramen. Pause for uh, no, that's not even a pause. That's like a, that's like a, you said that on purpose. But anyway, so the the word on the street literally broke in the internet. Actually, Uzi posted this on his Instagram last night. Me and my love about to take over the world. And then he got Uzi and he got Cardi. And we all know like the whole, uh, I don't know what it's called, like lore behind Cardi and Uzi. I mean, there was even an anime back in the day where a fan literally created like a whole story of them smacking cheeks. Who is the bottom and top? We don't know yet, but regardless. So we have the original photo. And for all the people who are claiming like, oh, he's satanic and whatever. Well, they got more evidence because this is the original photo. It's Devil and the two kids, Uzi and Cardi, said that they were, you know, he was underneath the devil. And I think I think demons or devil are portrayed as goats. It's some Maybe there's something to do with that. Like, greatest of all time. To be the goat, you have to praise Satanism or at least the devil and whatnot. But huh, that'll be into it. That'll be a different discussion. But as I was saying, so what does this mean exactly? Uzi and Cardi. Uzi posted this basically announcement that potentially there could be a collab with the two. People are saying like 16, 20, no, no, no. They're not making a whole, they're, they're too far into their careers to make a collab tape. However, a actual collab, like a song, definitely think is possible. Will it be on Cardi's album or Uzi's album? I'm thinking it might be on Uzi's. I just feel like Cardi... For some reason, I feel like he just don't want to give Uzi that, that uh, I don't know, that look. Even though Uzi's technically a bigger artist. I don't know, man. I just feel like Uzi would put him on pink tape before Cardi would put him on the upcoming project. Cardi's going to go big or go home or like go solo completely just because he's too, he's, he's too rock star. I, I, I don't know. But you don't see Cardi posting anything about Uzi. You just see Uzi posting about Cardi, but... Uzi's more in the public. So that's the first possibility. Collab with the two. Or it could just mean that both of them are dropping very soon, unfortunately. So remember, Uzi said he was on track 16 of Whole Lot of Red like three years ago. Well, that same thing could happen again. Uzi might not even end up being on the project. Stop gassing this weak post. Um, it seems like Myram, you're just a hater. I don't, I don't know. Like, what else could this mean? And I, I said the two possibilities. It could just mean they're both dropping. It, I don't know. Some people just come out and they're super depressed because every time they get excited, they beat themselves off too much and they came and they're like, oh, damn, like it didn't even happen. So they get all depressed just because their expectations weren't met. Again, we're given both of the possibilities. It doesn't necessarily mean that they're collabing, but uh, I, I don't need that negativity here, bro. Copium. That's a form of copium, in my opinion. To be all sad, like to expect nothing means that you will always be pleasantly surprised in the future. However, that's just not how I rock. You give me the information, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, oh wait, like we're not stoics out here. Yeah, sure, that might be the optimal strategy of life uh, if you're a robot, but like we're humans, we live off of emotions. If you don't have emotions, you're literally, again, a bot. I'm sorry. You're like, what? You, you're just not going to, oh, I'm not going to have intercourse with this chick because I don't want to get attached. It's like, okay, what's the whole point of living on this planet then? Like, you, you're just going to, there, there is no point of life then. Our, our evolutionary, uh, what is it? Like, th to fulfill the whole reason for life is to reproduce. And so if you're not, you know, smashing hosts and you're not having those feelings, then there was no point. You're just on this planet being a fucking asteroid. If you don't get what I'm saying, then go, go read on stoicism and other philosophies like that. But anyway, uh, yeah. So two possibilities, they could be dropping at both at the same time. I don't know if it's going to be on Cardi's project, but Uzi, I think is trying to get Cardi and I don't see any reason as to why Cardi would not clear that feature because it would give him a huge look, like just business wise. But again, you know how he is. He's not clearing certain songs or he just doesn't send back the verse. 
in time. Like we saw what Ian Connor sent with the text messages on Twitter in that Drake was even waiting on the pain 1993 verse that he was sending like the day before. Cause he didn't want no leaks. And it's like, bro, it's Drake. You should send that as soon as you record it after you mix and master it at least. But but uh, if you're not sending Drake the verse right after you record it, then he's definitely not sending Uzi that. Um, and so I wouldn't even be surprised if Uzi's waiting on that for a pink tape. And he said two months till it dropped because he's waiting on Cardi's verse solely. That's it. It's just his verse that they're waiting on. If Cardi tape and an Uzi tape drop on the same day, who would you listen to first? Oh, that is a good question. Uh, I might check like the features or I might check the song titles and then be like, okay, which one sounds better it, in the cover art? Maybe it's like a, it's like going into a bookstore. It's like, I know they tell you not to judge a book by its cover, but that's exactly what I do. Be like, okay, you know, this Cardi, this, this Cardi album got a future feature, but this Uzi one got like a. I don't, I don't even know, man. If if Uzi got the Cardi feature and Cardi doesn't have the Uzi feature, I'd listen to the Uzi album first. Save the best for last? No. I do not adhere to that at all because whenever I do something, I'll get bored very fast. So if I got two albums to listen to, I'm going to listen to the one that I like most or that I think I'll like most first because by that second album, I'm going to be tired, especially with how long albums are nowadays, like 25 tracks. like that. That takes an hour already right there probably even more so by that time i'm out i'm going to sleep do i think the song with drake could be on uzi's album i do i do i think this is i think this album is not for uzi is nothing to hold anything back for like eternal take he's got to meet expectations surpass expectations because they had such high standards and although eternal take still was a good album like he needs to I don't know. People were still disappointed. He was even disappointed because the original one leaked and then he didn't think it was all too great of an album. Like it didn't last as well as say whole lot. It didn't have the whole lot of red effect, if you will. And so this album, he needs to destroy all of the ratings. Like he needs to bring back, not necessarily the old Uzi sound, but he needs to have that level of influence and, and not just like TikTok songs. Although that is music, you know, marketing at this point. So why not?